So question number two today is uh, similar to question number one. Does God give us sickness to teach us something? Now, I actually want you to look at this in two ways. I would say a resounding no. I don't believe God gives us sickness. I think actually the Bible's really clear that the thief comes to kill, steal, and destroy. Jesus comes to give us life and life more abundantly. So every time Jesus encountered a sick person, you'll never once hear him say, the Father gave you this as a blessing. He said, an enemy did this. In uh, Luke 13, Jesus encounters a woman, crippled, bound over, um, with the spirit of infirmity, and he says, Satan did this. The Bible talks about the Lord turned the captivity of Job. Sickness is always seen as a bad thing that comes from the enemy. So does God give you sickness to teach you something? No, 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 no. Now again, I just want you to follow me and think with me. Think about this one for a few minutes. If God gave you sickness, imagine you're watching this today and you've got COVID. And uh, somebody says, well, yeah, God, maybe God gave me this to teach me something. Well, if God gave you that to teach you something, why would you take a painkiller? Why would you take a, go to a doctor? Why get yourself out of the will of God? Yeah? You know, I've never seen any Christian, if, when they go to a dentist, they're wracked in pain, maybe their child is in pain, pray and say, well, maybe God wants this pain. Maybe we should wait a few months with this raging jaw inflamed in pain. And no, we know exactly what the right thing is to do in those circumstances. It's somehow when we come to church, we get rid of, oh, hallelujah, the mighty wisdom of God. We become religious and you'll never see Jesus doing that. Now, one last thought about this, and it's really worth thinking about, can you learn things when you're sick? Yes. Are there many people who, frankly, the, they live far from God, God is not on the radar, and when they're sick, when they're off work, when they're in pain, they begin seeking God and they get closer to God? Yes. But that doesn't mean God sent them the thing to do that. And the thing is, those truths that you learned while you were sick, you can learn them while you're not sick. And I think actually the best thing to learn when we're sick is how to receive healing. Sarcasm intended. So can we learn things when we're sick? Absolutely. But that doesn't mean God sent them. Yeah, I use this example. When I was a young man, I walked away from the Lord through my own foolishness, my own brokenness. It wasn't really even so much about sin. It was, you know, the church I was in. I won't go through the whole story. Here's my thing. When I lived away from the Lord for several years and worked in business, I learned many valuable life skills that I now apply to ministry and financial management, things like that. But I didn't need to walk away from God to learn those things. I could have opened the book of Proverbs and learned them every day. I could have sought out wisdom that cried aloud in the marketplace that was available. I could have bought some Dave Ramsey books and learned some financial wisdom. So God didn't want me to walk away from him that I might learn some truths. Now God tries to redeem everything that the enemy sends. The enemy meant it for bad. God will try to turn it for God. God will work all things together for our good. It doesn't mean he's sending those things. So does God give us sickness to teach us things? A resounding no. God gives you the Holy Spirit to teach you things. God gives you his word to teach you things. Mm.